Hey guys, welcome back to Hungry Fusion. Today we are going to make palkova recipe with milk powder and jaggery. Usually palkova is made with white sugar and milk, but today we are going to make a simple and quick recipe of palkova with milk powder, jaggery, milk and ghee. It tastes like regular palkova and it's absolutely delicious. Let's jump into the making. Let's make the jaggery syrup first. For that, in a saucepan, I'm going to add half cup of jaggery. We need to melt the jaggery and filter it first. I'm adding quarter cup of water now. Do not add more water, otherwise your syrup will become watery. Just mix well until the jaggery dissolves in water. There is no need of any consistency, just turn off the heat once jaggery is dissolved. Now let's filter the jaggery syrup. This step is must if your jaggery have lot of impurities on it. See my jaggery syrup is on the thicker side, it should be like this. Set it aside and in another pan. Add 3 teaspoons of ghee. Use a non-stick pan if possible so that it would be easier for you to mix on. I am adding 1 cup of milk powder. Mix it well. You can use any milk powder for this recipe. And add quarter cup of milk and combine everything together. Do not add jaggery in the beginning as jaggery may curdle the milk. So add jaggery at last just before turning off the heat. Now let's add the jaggery syrup. Combine everything together. Jaggery crystallines faster than sugar so do not cook it longer mix everything well until the jaggery is well incorporated into the milk powder mixture once it starts to separate the pan remove it from heat cooking it longer may give a buffy like texture to the palkova now it is done, turn off the heat. You can also add cardamom powder or saffron strands for flavor. But for regular traditional palkova, they won't be adding anything. It is your preference. Transfer it into a small bowl, level it. I got about 300 grams of palkova from this recipe. You, with the same recipe, you can make peda, burfi or kalakand. See the creamy texture of the palkova which is done in just 10 minutes. This dough is good for about 2 days. As it is with milk, it spoils soon. Try this recipe today and comment your feedback. Share and subscribe to my channel if you like my videos. Stay tuned for more amazing recipes. Thank you.